Hi, this is Laura GB, and in this Power BI video, we're going to look at the new update to add a clear all slices button. So here we are in our report, and in the top left hand corner, I've got a couple of slices. So I can filter to say, just give me the south of the country. And you see in my map, we go down just down to the south of the country. And we can also go and say, give me just these five decades. And there we are. We've got just five decades and the south of the country. Now, I've done it before, which is you had to put a reset button in, you get bookmarks and things, and that works. But now they've added a new feature in the March 2023 edition of Power BI. So if we can go up to on the insert ribbon, make sure you're there, and then we go to buttons and look, there's a clear old slices button. And let's just drag that out of the top corner and put it in here. Let's resize it a little bit while we're here. And let's make it look like a button by going over to the right hand side and going to style. And I am just, I'm going to minimize the text and I'm just going to turn on the border. So there we are, we get a border. It looks like a button now. And if I, I'm in Power BI Desktop, so I need to hold down the control key and then I can click the button. And there you are, my slicers get set back to all. Great, clears all slicers. Solves that problem, nice, quick and easy. You need to be aware of one thing though. So let's go, let's go and put some values in again. So let's go for the, the southeast of the country. Okay, so basically excluding Wales, Cornwall and Northern Ireland. And then let's go and limit it down to one month. So in the frost days chart here, I'm going to click on January. And there we are. My max temp is also limited to January. If I go and click my clear all slices button now my slices go back to all but my filter by clicking on a visual is not reset if you need to do that go look at the video that's down below and that will show you how to do that so that was adding a clear all slices button to your power bi report my name's laura gb if you haven't already please press subscribe take care now